In this tutorial, I will show you how you can connect your OnTrack listings using a file. You will use a file when you have more than 10 or 20 OnTrack listings that you would like to connect and have them tracked on AutoDS. In order to do so, you will need to have a CSV file of your listings. If you're coming from a previous monitoring software, you can either ask their support for that CSV file or you can check if our extension, the AutoDS Helper, can extract these listings. At the bottom of this video, you'll be able to see a link to a tutorial showing you how to do so. Once you have the CSV file, there are two ways of syncing your items. You can have all your items mixed from the same, from different suppliers. As shown here, you will have the eBay item ID, the source item ID, the name of the source site, and the eBay site. Please note that these, this is how the buy sites will look like, and this is how the sell site will look like. You only need to have the part that is highlighted here in yellow. That's all you need to have. This is how you will fix the file that you will get from your previous system or if you get it with the help of our helper extension it will already automatically do so once you have this file you will be able to upload it here as is you will click connect on track listings with a file you will choose the file clicking here from your computer and then you won't have to choose anything here, you'll just be clicking update because the system will already know which item ID to assign to each source ID and upload ID. If you're only working with one supplier or you wanna be monitoring each supplier on its own, you will need to create a CSV file that looks like this. One column, column A, will have the eBay item ID, and column B will have the source ID. You will then be exporting it to CSV, so download to comma-separated values. It's highly recommended to use Google Sheets, as it always gives us the best CSV format. Once you did that, you can go back to the on-track listings page, look for the file, and then choose the specific supplier. If it's from Banggood, for example, to eBay US, if it's the warehouse in China, and you click Update. Once you do that, all the listings will be uh, moved to the active listings page and will be monitored. If something did not work out, you will see the reason for it here under the column status and you'll be able to fix it. If you have more questions, please check the help articles below or contact us at the support. We will be happy to assist you.